Good morning, oil traders. It is September 1st. It's 8.25 a.m. here on the East Coast, and we're just over an hour away from the market open at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time. And it's been an interesting morning. Uh, I ended up holding off on uh, buying long yesterday. We closed uh, about 10 cents above 47 yesterday, and it I had a gut feeling that we would at least get an attempt to drop below 47, at which point I would re-enter my long position or re-enter the additional long position I should say and it now given what's happened overnight in uh, in Asia and Europe it certainly looks like I'll have that chance um, how juicy a purchase price I'll be able to get well I guess we'll see um, we drifted down all night until 6 a.m. to a low of 46.64 and then started to move back up to where we closed yesterday above 47 um, of course, I would love to purchase at, uh, at the lows of this morning, um, but uh, we'll, we'll see. Um, but I will plan on being a little bit uh, more patient with the sale of my shorts. Um, where, we, where we saw, um, I think 46.70 um, is where I first saw it this morning, and I think that's a realistic target. Um, if we do drop back below 47 and that battle is currently raging, at the moment as I record this. Um, at 46.70, one, uh, one of my short positions purchased yesterday was up over 2%, um, but which technically is kind of within my range of selling. Um, but I think I would give it a little bit more time, assuming that I can get into my long position. Um, I'd like to get that hedge in place. Uh, so basically, if I were to get that purchase of the long, uh, basically no matter what happens today, I should be able to sell for a profit and start out the month of September on a good note. But we'll see how it actually uh, develops. Um, we've got a uh, rig count later today from Baker Hughes, um, probably not going to move the needle, um, but you know, it, it is what it is. And uh, that's my game plan. What's yours? Hit me up down below in the comments on YouTube, or you can check me out on tradingjournal.ca where you can find my updated portfolio with yesterday's purchases. You can see those here, 22 hours old. Um, and the results from yesterday's um, uh, long sale, I should say. That's the 3.13% uh, the there that you can see at the top of the list from August 31st. Uh, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to stay tuned, and I'll check back with you guys after the trading session or near the trading sessions close at 4 p.m. Eastern. Until then, good luck. Cheers.